Welcome to another episode of Star Mountain Outdoors and Bushcraft. This is John, and today we are hiking San Cowie. Come join me. Our short but magical journey just after mid morning. The entire group seemed to be in good spirits. As you can see, I'm hiking with quite a large group today. This group consists mainly of my wife's sisters and their families. A couple friends of one of the daughters too, so one of my nieces brought a couple friends along. And one of them's helping me film as well. Good job, Lori! Woohoo! <laughs> this was the first of several ladders to negotiate along the trail. As you can see, the trail winds around the rock face here. It's amazing how deep these paths were rutted in by the people who lived here in ancient times. They were formed by repetitive use over maybe hundreds or thousands of years. This repetitive use wore down the sandstone, forming the trails that you see now. have a choice to make here. We can take the skinny canyon or go up the ladder. I might want to do both. Unfortunately, I only had time to climb the ladder before the group started getting too far ahead of me. After that last climb, we were up on top of the mesa. You 
guys are so good helping with the carns, <laughs> doing the trail maintenance. Why, oh, did she knock one over? here and you can see the canyon below the highway up to Los Alamos here's a cool narrow part of the ridge here and I think I can see the trail down below where we're gonna end up and Nathan is setting the pace as per usual right now you are because you're in front of me Shh, don't tell him that Look at these gooseberries. Can we eat them? Oh. Choya flowers. These are pretty cactuses when they bloom. Sunflowers. There's a lizard. Mm -hmm. All right, looks like we've got some obstacles to negotiate here. We're just going to go down the ladder that's down there. That's an obstacle. Sorry. That's one of those high intensity surface ships. Is it a ladder ships. or is it just a yep. narrow walkway? So these ladders are how the native Pueblo people used to get up and down from their houses. Oh, you're turning YouTube on? Someone in particular. My general Sophie. audience. Oh, okay. Sophie. <laughs> Sophie. So do you edit a lot of this stuff, or do you just? Oh yeah. Put in the it takes hours and hours of editing. Pure. Listening Usually to all of us. Usually all of us swearing. <laughs> Usually it's just me and Janola. Here's Lisa's water bottle holder. It's very handy. <laughs> All right, here I go. Oh, this is not easy. It would help to have two hands. And we're down. Oh, that's a long step for that last one. All right. Cruising light right along here. The rest of the group is way ahead of me. Hope you guys are enjoying the hike. We'll see you in a few. sample of the views they had from this pathway. That's my niece Jillian enjoying the view. My wife and I emerging from behind the rock. My niece Sophie ascending the ladder. Right, 
I will zoom out here so that you can get an idea of the scale of the landscape. for me to see with the glare in the viewfinder, but there's some petroglyphs in here. And you can see the trail we came in on there. and my son Nathan descending one of the steeper parts. Sophie's just going to beat Claudia. Oh! Oh, it's, it's on. It's not a race, Nathan. Ooh. Look at this path right here. It was, it was made by two foot paths with a gap in the middle. And it just wore down really deep. Pretty cool. see right here where somebody had an ancient house the holes in the rock are where they put their vigas or beams which supported the roof and they lived below that expansive views to the south of the mesa More petroglyphs. Honestly, I'm not sure how much historical or educational benefit we got out of this hike, but I know that we all had a good time. Thank you for watching another episode. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And uh, check out the links down below. You can uh, click on my hike for and donate to the American Cancer Society for my Appalachian Trail hike. Or you can donate to my GoFundMe. I also have an online store. So again, thank you for watching and have a good one.